House of Style. I'm Bianca Nicole and today I'm here to bring you a new subscription service that I've never tried before and I haven't really seen many reviews on this particular company um, on any of the YouTube channels. Uh, so I'm here to bring this to you and we're going to see how this works out together and if it's even worth the price of it. So yeah, let's get into it. So, here is the box that it came in, and this is a home subscription diffuser essential oil type of service. So basically, you pay for the diffuser, and then you can subscribe to a monthly subscription where you get to pick your, your scent. And each month or every 30 days, they will send you a refill of whatever essential oil you picked for your diffuser. So, I picked, um, I think you can only get, I think there's a black and I think it's just gold. I'll list the colors across the screen for you guys um, if, there are, if there are any color options. And um, they have so many different scents to choose from. And um, I'll also list the price right here across the screen for you guys. Because I can't remember it off the top of my head. But this um, subscription service is from Hotel Collection. And I found them on Instagram. And I saw a, an ad for them on Facebook just randomly through my feed, scrolling through it. And I thought, I absolutely love coming home to... A house or an apartment that just smells clean and inviting and I love when people come over and they say that oh your house smells so good what is it you're using so I used to have those Glade um, diffusers that you hang on the wall and they would just randomly like psh, shoot out a mist however many minutes it goes because it's like three settings on the little slider button and I used to have those all over um, the house in each room Especially by the front door because I wanted it to smell like really inviting when you walked in. And those things add up. I was spending, I don't know, I, I get one for each room. So maybe 40, 50 bucks on refills of the little oils each month. And um, I started looking into home scent systems. And I found the Hotel Collection. And they offer a diffuser that will scent up to a certain amount of square feet and the oils that they make use some sort of special diffusing technology where the actual um it's like nanoparticles and there's no like water or alcohol in the actual um oils or the diffuser to like dilute your scent so it lasts longer because it's more concentrated and I thought, well, why don't I just try this out and bring it to you guys and we can try this out together and see if it's worth it. So this is my first ever home scent system. And I paid, I want to say $99 for the, the actual diffuser. And I'm going to set this in my living room. And if I like it, I might purchase one more for just the entryway. And um, I think monthly... If you sign up for the subscription service, you do save a little bit of money. You get like a percentage off. But I'm going to list all of the information on the screen as well as the links in the description bar. So you guys can go check it out. And um, let's just get into it. I just got it today. I'm super excited. Um, I ordered this back in January. Like the third week of January. And I am just now getting it. And it's... <laughs> Just now turning the first week of February. Today is the third, I want to believe, I want to say. So, I got the 
Sweetest Taboo. I got the 120 milliliter size, and I will be getting a, um, a refill of this scent, or I can go in and change it on the website to get a different scent if I want to switch it up for the season or month, which I haven't quite figured out how to do yet. I am... Um, I'll let you guys know on the next box if I'm able to do it and how you go about doing it. And uh, we like it. We'll keep this. If we don't, then I'll get rid of it. But it can't hurt to try. So let's, let's get into this. So I got one 120 milliliter bottle of essential oil. And I got the diffuser in my box here. So let's see. This is what it looks like inside of the basic brown box that it came in and I'm going to set this down so I could just pull it out of the oops, box without ripping up some stuff. Okay, so here we have the actual box. So here we have the box that it comes in and it just says hotel collection on the front. And let's see. Oh, it's got a little handle. Cute. So that's what the diffuser looks like, I'm guessing. So let me open this up. Let's see. I need to. So I got my nails done because I'm trying to be that bitch this year, okay? <laughs> I'm just playing. Er, I got my nails done because I just want to be cute and... You know, getting your nails done just makes you feel like you're that beep. You know what I mean? At least it does for me. And I just, I haven't had my nails done in so long. So I went ahead and got them done. Aren't they cute? Just basic, but still love them. So it comes with this little like foam piece on the top. And then everything is packaged really well. And this company is based out of um, Miami, Florida. So... I'm going to set this down here because I have stuff all over this table you guys would not believe. So, here we have a remote for the diffuser. And it has, this is the aroma diffuser remote control. So, it has on there the density. So, you can go up or down on the density. Um, you can do 20. 35, 50, 65, 80, and 95 percent concentration, and then it has a timer at the bottom, so you could do one, four, or eight hours. So, you guys can kind of see. Sorry for the blurriness. Um, what else? We got this little piece. I'm not quite sure what this is yet. And this is the oil, by the way. I got the um, Sweetest Taboo. This one is a scent that's inspired by the Aria Hotel and Casino in Vegas. So each of their scents on the website are inspired by world-famous hotels and the scents that these hotels, um, I guess, have when you go into them. So each fragrance is inspired by something like that and that I guess that's where they get the name Hotel Collection. So we're going to try out the Sweetest Taboo because Aria is supposed to smell like really sweet and candy-like and I just thought that would be perfect for Valentine's, for the month of Valentine's, the month of love, to just have it smell sweet and candy and seductive. So that is why I chose this fragrance. And um, let's see what this is. This is a extra lid. I don't know what that's about. I guess we'll find out shortly. Here is the plug-in. So you have your electric cord for your diffuser. And let's get to the actual diffuser itself. So here is the actual diffuser. Let's take it out of its baggie. And I think that is everything in the box. Yep. There's no instructions. Let me see. Okay. So, yes, the instructions are at the very bottom of the box underneath this foam thing. So, don't throw the box away. Like, completely take everything out if you get one of these. 
and you'll find this, I guess this is the instruction manual sheet. All right, so this diffuser is really nice. It's metal and it's heavy. It feels like a, a torpedo or something, like artillery shell. This thing is heavy and well-made, heavy duty. So this looks like the, where the uh, the spray will come out. Here you have your port for your plug-in and then your indicator lights are right here. And then you have the logo hotel collection there. So now we need to just figure out how to load it. And it looks like you just twist and pull. And so you have this inside is the inside of it. And then this is, is this glass or plastic? This is a plastic um, reservoir here. I'm guessing this is where you pour the oil into. So it looks like you just unscrew and I guess fill the reservoir with your oil of choice that you ordered and then plug it in to charge it and go from there. We'll see. I'm going to set this here and open up the instruction manual and kind of see what it says. And we will be right back. All right, so carefully. All right, we're gonna try this out. So, what do we do? I have no idea what I'm doing here, guys. Do I need to take this off? No. So you put this in here like this, and you screw it on. Okay, guys, so what you do, this empty bottle, okay, so this empty bottle right here is included for you to clean your diffuser once a month or once every two months just to keep it from getting clogged up. And then you're gonna take your oil and you're gonna screw it into the bottom of the diffuser like this. So, there you have that. Okay, so once you have your oil in place, you're gonna just set this on top and then kinda like get it in there, like set it in there good and then turn it and lock it. So it should look like that. Okay guys, so I have my diffuser set up. So once you get the oil in and you've closed it tightly and secured it, you're going to plug this into the back of it right here and then plug this unit into the wall wherever you want to have your scent diffused. So all of the parts that came in there, we have the diffuser, we have the remote control, we have the power adapter cord, and this thing right here, which I couldn't figure out what it was, is actually a spare nozzle. So if your nozzle um, is not diffusing properly even after you clean it, that means it's time to replace it, and they've included that in the system. And then, um, of course, you have an empty bottle, and that is what I guess this lid is for. So we'll keep all of this together so we don't lose it. And um, there's three different lights on there. You have a blue LED light, which means that the device is powered on. You have the green LED light, which is gonna tell you that the scent is being diffused. And then you have the red LED light, which flashes when any button on the remote is being pressed. So that's what those, um, those lights will indicate on there. And all of this is gonna be in your manual. I'm just kind of going over it with you if you're new to this thing like I am. Um, it might be something interesting for you to know. So on the remote, you have the um, your density. So this can increase your aroma in, um, intensity by 10%. So if you press it 10 times, you'll get maximum uh, density of the aroma. And then of course, if you hit the minus sign 
up there 10 times where it says density right up in there, then it'll decrease it by 10% all the way down for minimum density. And then there's the, um, there's a green button up here that says aroma. And that is, that will cause the unit to work continuously. So it'll just continue to diffuse the scent. And then you have the um, percentage buttons, which are in blue. And this means um, it'll allow you to control the scent concentration, concentration by adjusting the scenting intervals. So you get 20, 35, 50, 65, 80, or 95%. And then um, you have the hour intervals down there. So if you press the one hour, then the scent, the diffuser will run continuously for an hour, or you can have it run for four hours or up to eight hours continuously. And then um, that's what all of this is for. So there's a bunch of different things on there and it claims to have 3,000 hours of motor life to the diffuser. So that's a long time. And it gives you tips for proper usage, maintenance, how to replace the nozzle, and then um, like a little registration down here for your diffuser. So definitely don't throw this out, you guys. You'll need it. And then um, all the parts that are included. So now I'm just going to go plug it in and um, kind of play with it and see how this works. I'm going to give it a month and see, um, work out all the kinks and get used to it and let you guys know how much or like how much of an area it's scented because I live in a two bedroom apartment. So, you know, it's not that big. I don't remember how many square feet are in here. I'll find that out. And then, um, I'll find out the specs on how many feet this diffuser is supposed to scent. And then I will leave all of this down here below. And um, at the end of the month, when I get my next shipment of the hotel collection sent in, I'll let you know how this month went and whether I think it is worth keeping or not. And also, um, if it's noisy in my review of the whole thing. But yes, today I just wanted to kind of bring you a new subscription service for the home. And we're going to try this out together. And we're going to see if it's worth it. And I'll give you an update by next month when I get the new um, oil bottle in. And then we'll just go from there. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this unboxing. I hope you find it interesting. And I hope you guys are enjoying my content. I'm really trying to kind of just play around and find the things that I like to do and bring them to you guys and hope that you enjoy following me. And until the next video, bye.